You were all talk when you left here. But you've nothing to show for it, D. I'll spare me pay. We should have sullied forth in the first place. Surely the turn is mine. I believe it's my turn next. Honestly, you make more noise than the rabble at a feast. Even if you did stop its raging flow, it will soon burst through. Well then, let us see how far the flow brings them this time. We each have a lifespan of 10 years. We call them terms. Life begins with our first term and ends at the close of our 10th. Victory! And over the course of those 10 years, we fight continually. What kind of pep talk is that? Of course we're gonna survive. I've thought about this a lot, about what I can achieve, what I'll leave behind. Then I think of tomorrow and the tremors are back. Will I see the same faces when I wake? Will I even be around to see them? Huh. Get ready! Now, the enemy is before you. Chase them to the ends of the world. Unchecked, Ouroboros will leave this world to ruin. You must be erased. These soldiers will nourish me, and we can always grow plenty more. Stop toying! With everyone's life! Ah! You gave us a choice. The choice not to fight. And you made it true. That mark there. Late tenth term, eh? Three months left. That about right? Three more months. And then I'll be gone from this world. How many of you are getting made an example of and hopes rest this time? The lost numbers are attacking! We have good reason to meet with them, to bring peace, and to set the world to rights. But take a look around. <gasps> Think about how many lives it's cost. Annihilated is not a moving! This is bad, Noah. Now I want to live. To live and learn. So don't give up yet. This will buy you some extra time. Use it! Stop this! I don't want any of your time! If the world holds our lives back, I will end it! These are our lives here! They're not some toys you can just play with! It is fate. Many have tried. But none have ever managed to escape its flow. What is it they need to stay alive? Water? Food? Certainly. But what we need most... is life itself. Taking each other's lives. With the taken flames becoming your own in turn. This is the world of Ionios. The nations of Kevis and Agnes and their grisly conflict stand in contrast to its natural splendor. All this killing for the sake of filling one's own flame clock. From the moment of birth, fighting is all the people of Ionios learn. Their fate leads to everyone's destruction. Their lifespans are a mere 10 years. Surviving on the battlefield, fulfilling that 10-year lifespan of service, and receiving a homecoming ceremony in front of their queen is the highest honor. However, many never receive this honor as they fall in battle. Their souls evaporating into the beyond as the melody of the Offseers plays.
In today's presentation, we'll introduce the world of Xenoblade Chronicles 3 and follow the main character's adventures. Countless comrades have lost their lives thanks to this filth. What do you think it's like for us? Losing friend after friend. You steal everything from us. Six soldiers, three from Kevis and three from Agnes, were commissioned to take part in a special mission. Both parties, filled with mutual hatred, draw their weapons at first. But when they encounter a mysterious figure, they shelve their distrust and resolve to work together. Because now, kids, you share a common destiny. They'll hunt you constantly, relentlessly without rest. There's one place that might give you a chance. Sword March. The land pierced by a great sword. Our city. Defeat the real enemy and restore the world to order. This story focuses on these six characters. This is what we're meant to do. To send on the voices of the departed is an offseer's purpose. Ready, he says. From the moment I chose this muddy path, I've been more than ready. The spark you on about? I'm not gonna let you take the fall alone. I've thought about this a lot. About what I can achieve. What I'll leave behind. If anything, we should be questioning all that we've thought to be true. Differences are all a matter of perspective. The truth is, she's terrified. She needs someone to tell her that everything will be all right. Now fugitives of both Kevis and Agnes, these fate-defying hopefuls journey to learn the truths of their world. Their role is to convey the Queen's directives to the colonies, along with handling admin and decision-making. Our colonies regard each other as enemies. But if the consuls giving the orders are the same, it means... That these guys are mega suspicious? I suspect they may be more deeply involved than we thought. With the reason why we fight. With deciding our fate. Our fate. now, Mimi. Hey, look! There! Mimi, look! It's water! There's an oasis! Wa water? Water! Let's just hope it's not a mirage. Ionios is host to various landscapes, all filled with surreal geography to explore and diverse wildlife to encounter. Like the lands they inhabit, the wild creatures here range from docile to dangerous. Some creatures make no secret of their ferocious tendencies, so keep caution in mind. You'll also encounter the soldiers of Kedis and Agnes, who continue to fight throughout the land. Colonies serve as the base camp for both nations. At the heart of each colony is a Pharaonis. These are mobile bases and devastating weapons of war. Seek out these colonies to shop. Dine. Whew, all finished. Get to know residents and more. 
Get a glimpse of the lives of Noah and his friends at these rest spots, founding colonies and throughout the world. Use collected materials to cook. Craft gems to strengthen your abilities. Looks good to me. I think we'll find this useful. And discuss information you hear about from Let's residents to take on new quests. Explore every corner of these fields as you seek out new encounters. Breathtaking scenery. Valuable items. And ferocious monsters. Enjoy the world and fulfill your wanderlust at your own pace. The locations you visit are saved as landmarks that you can quickly select and travel to, which makes traversing this giant world more manageable. By enabling a navigation feature, you can set a course for your next destination without fear of losing your way. There are plenty of other features that will help you on your adventure, such as the ability to change the time of day to encounter monsters that only appear at specific times. Lance! Draw his attention for me! Uni! Cover fire! Leave it to me! Tyon! Senna! We need you too! <laughs> Understood. Just say when, guys! Thanks, everyone. I'll count down from three. Three, two, one! Let's go! Draw your weapon when encountering an enemy to seamlessly enter battle. Make your approach to attack automatically. Then, harness powerful abilities called arts to strive for victory. Arts have a variety of effects. Some can throw opponents off balance. Inflict more damage based on where you attack from. Or heal allies, to name a few. Each art is assigned to a button, making them simple and easy to execute. Each character takes on a specific role during battle. Attackers excel at damaging enemies. Defenders block enemy attacks and draw their aggro. And healers can restore HP to keep you in fighting shape. Each character playing their role effectively is a key point to battling. You can freely swap the character you control at any time. String together arts to activate a combo and gain an advantage. Get the enemy off balance. Knock them to the ground. Launch them into the air, then smash them down. Stringing together successful combos is quite satisfying. You can link multiple arts with stunning chain attacks to devastate enemies. Deal heaps of damage at once and let nothing stand in your way. An icon just popped up over your head. Yours seems to be the only one not logged. Huh? He's lit up like a sparking light bulb. I've never used this kind of blade before, but all the techniques I can use with it are flashing before my eyes. Each character in your party has a class that influences how they battle. Don't know how this is even working, but cool. 
Each class has its own attributes. Sword Fighter. Lead the fight with this well-balanced attacker class. Zephyr. Evade attacks and unleash powerful counters. Medic Gunner. Restore allies HP and strengthen their abilities from a position of safety. Tactician. Disrupt enemies and support allies using paper talismans called Mondo. Heavy Guard. Wield massive weapons to defend allies and draw enemy aggro. Ogre. Crush enemy defenses with massive power. Your class can also be changed to match that of your allies. Spend time learning multiple classes for a well-rounded team. Experience earned on the battlefield increases your class rank and lets you learn Master Arts, a set of beneficial arts that can be added to a different class. With Master Arts, even your defender can take a moment to heal their allies. The more arts and combat strategies you wield, the easier it'll be to blaze through battles. Also, by combining compatible arts, you can unleash fusion art attacks that combine the effects of two arts into one. Live fiercely, die spectacularly. That's how I want the battlefield of my life to be. It's just that, as a mechanic, you can't start getting moody just because something's broken. Now we see real Nopon potential. That's right! Maybe it's impossible for one Nopon. But not for two. I just wish I wasn't such a weakling. I can't run away from my responsibility. Doing the same as everyone around you, it's always the same outcome. Following the playbook to the letter is hardly a strategy. Whoever goes up against me, they're getting crushed. Brave residents of Ionios called heroes can lend their arms and aptitude to your team as a seventh party member. Only one hero at a time can assist on the battlefield, but you can swap them out as you see fit. Heroes also bring their own classes to your team. Guardian Commander. Turn the tables with boosted abilities when things look dire. Incursor. Unleash more critical hits for higher attack power. War Medic. Heal party members and bolster them with various buffs. These are only a handful of classes that heroes bring. Your party members can take on any of the hero classes as they become your allies. Recruit more heroes for a growing combination of classes and arts in your party. Choose to don a class's look or keep your current outfit. Find your fashion and fight for the future. Creature. It's something else. You've got a real death wish. Ah! <gasps> Get out the way. You're just slowing me down. The nerve on this guy. One down. Good start. It's not over yet. I felt her thoughts, or maybe her memories. There were so many, and then they were a part of me.
By joining together in battle through interlinking, two characters in your party can fuse into a fiercely powerful form known as an Ouroboros. Here are the character pairs that can interlink. Transform into this fearsome fusion by interlinking during combat. Clear out the battlefield by using mighty Ouroboros arts before time is up and the interlink deactivates. Those guys are so selfish. Selfish how? You know what I mean. Every time we interlink, they're the ones taking the lead. So you'd prefer to take the raids? I just want to do more. Like, pull my weight. You know? Lance, come with me! I'm all set! Despite being a single body, the Ouroboros is controlled by only one of the two characters. Swap between them to modify the form and arts of the Ouroboros to fit your approach. Earn points in battle to make the already powerful Ouroboros even stronger. Ouroboros can also take part in chain attacks with the rest of the party. We were sworn enemies once, and yet we all share the will to live in the now. Until now, I was afraid to take that first step. But now, I can do it. Not like we can afford to go just yet. So now, I ain't afraid. Yeah, I'll keep going while my flame still flickers to the bitter end. But I'm gonna change! Both me and this world! We'll build it for ourselves! A world with the freedom to choose! Broaden the world of Xenoblade Chronicles 3 with a paid expansion pass. You can get the additional content shown here. Xenoblade Chronicles 3 is compatible with amiibo figures. Tap any amiibo to acquire helpful in-game items for your adventure. Tap the Shulk amiibo to change a character's sword to appear as the Monado when using Noah's Swordfighter class. Xenoblade Chronicles 3 launches July 29th. A collector's edition that includes an art book and steel case will also be available. Thank you for watching and enjoy your adventures in the world of Ionios.